Tempest du jour, they send her off to Shady Pines. You could find her in the bingo hall, inserting laxatives in her behind. <laughs> she lost all that weight in her prime, she was tight. Now she's eating applesauce with her friend Betty White. Tempest du jour was a cat in a hat who got told she was old by a whole bearded rat. She had things to say, cause the bitch was so whack, but then got out danced and she fell to the back. Now her nurse is her only fan. Even her kids don't want to follow an ancient man. She's old and saggy like rotten fruit. I guess it wasn't just that new bodysuit. <laughs> Tempest du jour, people say that she's done. She's so old, her social security number is one. If she were to fall, 911 gets the call. Death drop, they said. Now poor Tempest is dead. <laughs> For just 69 cents a day, you can supply Miss du jour with a box of adult diapers. <laughs> For a small monthly donation, we can pay Tempest's children to build her a new walker. What's that bitch name again? <laughs> oh, who? <laughs> <laughs> A young bedroom queen too big for her britches. She really thought she could compete with these bitches. She came in with whimsy and puppets in tow, but her little friend couldn't help her. The bitch had to go. <laughs> the queens were challenged to bring their best gaga, but James showed up in literal caca. She tried her best to do a tumble pass, but all she did was land flat on that ass. Her drag is still crusty. Her life is a wreck. Now all this girl needs is just a paycheck. Filming in her bathroom was cute for a bit, but likes and subscribes, that don't pay for shit. So ends the tale of James Mann's face. Delusional queen thought she came in first place. Still scouring the streets for secondhand wigs. So please throw a penny at this busted ass pig. <laughs> she doesn't need much. Just a buffalo nickel. And maybe some new tights. She's just a child. A 312 month old baby. <laughs> With every donation, you'll receive a free pair of noise canceling headphones so you can block out that god awful voice. <laughs> Kamora hails from the windy city. Little did she know her tail would soon get the strongest earlobes in all the race, but we saw how fast that she painted her face. She's a legend, she's a star, but she's back to tip spots at her local bar. <laughs> Every queen has their day, but there was just one line she couldn't quite say. She said, I was rooting for us, I mean, damn. She even patted her bust. Her time came and went and it was all gone in a flash. So reach into your pockets and give her some cash. <laughs> Did you know that some drag queens have to get ready in less than seven hours? <laughs> Every five minutes, a drag queen develops elephantitis in her earlobes. Somewhere, right now, there's a poor little drag queen crying and untucked because, well, she's safe again this week. <laughs> <laughs> Donate just an hour of your time so we could give her the attention she needs. When we reach our donation goal, we'll do these tired queens the ultimate service of putting them to sleep for good. You can sponsor a drag queen like Kamora by donating a sensible 74 cents. That way she can buy a watch. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sarah McLaughlin. And this is wrong on so many levels. Ah!